Hey guys, it's just Villa Cloth here, and today in some of this Monster Legends Leaks video, I'm going to be going over all of this week's events and the main event for next week in Monster Legends. So let's get into the main event next week, and then we'll go into this week's events. So next week, the Pirate Wreck Maze will start. That will start on Friday, and obviously it will be a maze, as it says in the name, and you will be able to get that Cosmic Mythic right there. We don't know its moveset yet, and we don't know its trade or anything about it, but we do know its design, and it is right there, and it looks pretty cool. I like how it has, like, an arm with a mouth. It's kind of cool. <laughs> so, yeah, now let's get into this week's events. So, on Monday, the Chicken by Night maze is still going on. Uh, I don't think you can get it if you haven't started yet, though, because the limited time path will be ending very soon. But there might be a Panda Explorer path that will give you some chests, so you could look out for that because they have been doing that within the past couple of mazes. But that usually only happens on the last day, so look out for that on Thursday. And then there's also a Vault Keys Challenge, which isn't really worth spending gems on and worth doing, really. And it'll be over by the time this video comes out anyway, so you guys don't have to worry about that. Then the last pass breeding starts today, and it goes all the way until Wednesday. I don't really know if that's worth it either, because it's just for some legendaries. And then the Forsaken Days is only today too, so it won't be out when this video comes out. But it's not really worth it either, because it only gives you legendaries. So, yeah, and then we have Captain Copperbeard's Mini Challenge starts on Tuesday, and then Hopkins Challenge on Wednesday. Those ones cost gems for a legendary, so it's not really worth it. Same with the Flamerion Challenge on Thursday. And then the Arrow Royalty Duel starts on Thursday. You guys should definitely do that if you have a ticket and you have enough monsters from this season. So, yeah, definitely do that because you can get some amazing rewards from that, and it's just definitely worth it. And then on Friday is where the big hitters come in. That's when you can breed the Dew, which is a Cosmic Mythic. And you will have a new Legends Pass, Cosmic Era Season 7, which is amazing. And the Teddy VR and Quaxo Croc path start. So if you have Teddy VR, you can actually rank him up from that. And if that wasn't enough... You also have the Ordo Draconis Marathon, which starts. So definitely log in on Friday. There's so much to do throughout that through Sunday and maybe even more. Or yeah, through all the way until Thursday of next week because that's when the race will end. So you guys should definitely be doing the race because the Ordo Draconis Marathon definitely seems worth it. The monster and it looks really good. So I definitely suggest that you guys try to get the monster. Definitely try to find a team now. I have a video on how to prepare for the race. I made it like a couple of days ago. It wasn't that long ago. If you just go to my videos, you can find it pretty easily. So yeah, that's about it for this week and one of the events for next week in Monster Legends. Stay tuned for another video next Tuesday on the same exact thing with the events for next week and the week after. Because I do these every single week. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.